What's up everybody, just to say before the video starts that I had a problem with my microphone for the first seven minutes but it's just me getting ready to go out and fight the witch boss. So there's a little bit of background white noise. If it's too annoying for you, just skip forward to the seven minutes mark and it's all sorted. Enjoy. What's up everybody and welcome back to Last Day on Earth Survival. So today the update has come out that celebrates the anniversary. So Last Day on Earth has turned one year old. To celebrate the occasion we have prepared a fun and colourful event for you. Crush enemies with your bare hands and get gifts. That sounds pretty damn fun. Sounds like we're going to be fighting a giant piñata that probably hits back. Alright now what have we got going on here? The Horde in the Infected Forest. A new creature has appeared in the Infected Forest. The Witch. Apparently, she is directly connected with the zombie horde. They also say that she possesses the ability to control and even summon them. Stock up on guns, explosives, ooh, and first aid kits, and check for yourself which of those rumours are actually true. Killing the witch may yield you trophy that can be activated. Beware of thorny plants as they are damaging. That sounds pretty cool. And game balancer features. We have updated the recipe for the recycler. You can now disassemble even tiny pieces like bolts, bearings, and wires. Oh, cool. I wonder if you can turn the wire into copper. We'll have to look into that. From now on, you'll need fewer resources to feed the dogs. I love that. It's going to take less meat to feed the doggos. And we have, had, we have updated our terms and conditions as well as our privacy policy in accordance with the soon-to-be-enforced EU law on protection, on personal data protection. Find out the details by clicking on the rules button located on the game settings. So there you go, everybody. Go and read them. Right. Let's load in and see what the game's going to do for us. And I have been tagged multiple times in Discord. Sorry, I've got a SOG stuck in my head. Right, let's, let's get a little bit of game audio on in here and load into our base. Take a quick look, see if we can recycle, recycle the wire to get copper. That'll be pretty cool if we can. Oh, a dog barked at us. Hey doggy, how's he doing? Oh yeah, and our um, white dog has made his, made its way into there, made her way. I think she's a she. Right, let's, um, I just want to see this, and there we go, wire. Will it give us copper? Nope, only gives scrap, but it takes copper to make. That makes sense, doesn't it? Alright, so, we're going to want to head over. Alright, let me just quickly drop all of this stuff. Alright, so it said we're going to want guns and explosives. So I'm thinking grenade launcher, that should be good, and med kits. So yeah, we're just going to go straight to try and take out the new witch, see what we can do with her. But we're going to be wanting to take a lot of guns, I'm guessing. Right, can I eat up? Nom, 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 nom. Perfect. Right, first aid kits. Let's get... Um, you know what? The big one takes a lot of first aid kits when you fight them, so just to be on the safe side, we'll go 60 first aid kits, 20 bandages. That should be enough, I'd hope. Let's get an AK. Let's get this. Um, we can, actually, we can do the auto shotgun, can't we? Have they fixed, I think they might have fixed the auto shotgun. Hmm. Definitely looks like it, doesn't it? Oh, well, we'll have to try it when we get over there. Um, have we got any better armor, like full health SWAT? Oops, didn't actually equip it. Full health SWAT, full health SWAT. And are there any trousers? There we go. All right, so we're in full SWAT gear. We could do, oops, I didn't mean to do that. We'll equip these. There we go. Right, and let's throw them away. Okay, so we're going to want us to get ourselves a grenade launcher, I'm thinking. And fortunately, I've got a grenade launcher somewhere. There we go. Let's get that one. Let's take a standard bag one of them. Another one. You know what? We could use a scar. Why not? Um, so let's, let's try and get this all ordered. Let's not take a Glock with us. Let's go like that. Put the meds like that. Put these here, and you know what? We'll take a whole load of shotguns just in case. 
because if we do have to leave the zone, then we'll lose any progress we've put into damaging her, the witch. And you know what? Let's take one more of these as well, and hope it's not complete overkill. All right, 89.89 for food and water. Sounds pretty good to me. Let's go see if we can fight this new witch. Oh, and I want to check quickly. Have they done anything to the raiders? Uh, no. Just waiting on two more visits to an airdrop, then we can go and raid. And our threat timer is currently one day, 20 hours. Was that? Uh, nope. One day, 35 minutes. Two skull threat. Oof. Alright, let's go out and possibly lose all of our guns. Hopefully we don't. Hopefully we just have to shoot her down. Ooh. Yo, we'll, we'll go to that afterwards. Ah, oh, look at that. They've changed the icon for the infected forest. Let's drive over there. Right, so... We've got this event. I'll click on it and just see what the information about it is. Right, wait until that's done. Um, doesn't tell you anything. It's just called Forest Meadow. Awesome. Let's see if we can kill this new witch. And hopefully get the trophy. Right. Oh, you know what? I th I think I should um head over to sector seven and get the damage buff. Now we'll see if we can um take a look at her quickly. So it does look like they've removed the big one from this forest. Do they drop anything differently now? No. Okay, so we do need to be careful of these spikes. Oh, and what's this here? Oh, okay, so we actually need C4. Alright, so it meant actual explosives, not like grenade launcher. Okay, let's go and grab a couple of bits of C4 and we'll come back, so I'll see you all in a second. What's up, people? Going back in from Sector 7, having just completed all of the anomaly stuff. It's taken about half an hour to do, roughly. So it's not too bad. I did notice one thing, though. The, um... There we go. Let's do that quickly. Devs listened to my suggestion. They've put a link to Discord in the settings. I think that's pretty damn cool. So hopefully we're going to be getting a nice big flood of people into the official Last Day on Earth Discord. Speaking of which, there should be a... That if you join my Discord, there's a link in the description, there's a link to the official Last Day on Earth Discord in my channel. I would say I'd put it in the description of here, but as you all know, I always forget to put things in description or overlay. Right then. To the witch. Got some C4 with me. It's all in my chopper. And hopefully, this isn't too horrible to do. We'll have to find out. And I think I need to scale it down a little bit, don't I? Ah, oh, whatever. It's fine. I'm sure you all don't mind a blue bar along the side of the screen. Right, let's grab one of the C4. And go onwards with... Well, I found the witch. Okay. Yep. She does a lot of damage. And she is freaky looking. Okay, and she's just spawned a horde. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, no! Ah! Holy crap. Make it. Ah! These are not friendly. This is not a fun place to be. Oh dear. Okay. Um, give me a moment. Ugh. That's horrible. Alright, I need to sort out my guns here. <sighs> that wasn't horribly terrifying at all. Right. Um, uh, yeah, just, just ignore me whilst I have a panic attack for a second. Look how much damage is already done to everything. Right, I think we need to... Right, we should, in theory, use medkits when I press Q again now. Because that wasn't working for some reason there. But holy crap, the witch is scary. Do not take on the witch. Okay, so those two need to switch around. 
Do not go anywhere near the witch unless you've got SWAT armor and medkits. There we go. Requires C4 explosive. Okay, so we have already blown up one of them. Right, so I think what we need to do is blow up all of those things to stop the witch from being able to heal. Is that her? It is. Out, spiky balls. And now switch over to the AK. Okay, where is she going to heal? Where is she running off to? Alright, forget about that. Let's just. Alright, so yeah, you do need to kill. Oh, they're not crawling, they're running! Why has she called them crawlers? Come on, devs, that's not a crawling zombie. Uh... Okay, yeah, um... Oh, dip. That was a lot of damage. Ow. Leave me alone! Uh... I really do not like this witch. All right, we need Oh, it. We need to get a different gun equipped. Nope, don't try and do this with them attacking. No, nope. Okay, we got this, we got this. Fuck. Right, um... Uh... We just lost so much stuff. Question is... Hang on, I'll ask in the Discord. <laughs> that was so painful. We've just lost so much. Oh, mm. I, I don't even know what to do now. We just lost. Ugh. That was all of our... That honestly hurts so much. This witch is so hard to kill. Um, Have I got one of these? No. What else do I need? A helmet. <laughs> I want to cry. How? How did we mess that up so badly? Uh, let's, let's equip that. There we go. We've still got some guns. In fact, we've probably still got enough to go and kill her. But if I die out there again and lose all of this, I'm just stuffed. I'd rather not try and use Glocks against her. Huh. Fully modded AK, that'd be nice. Take some of these. Um, don't bother taking that, just go like these, 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 these. And we need C4. Oh my god, I can't believe that! We just lost everything oh and that's not gonna be enough guns to take out we need more guns than this if we're going back we've got to go all out on it there we go I think that should be enough I think grenade launcher is probably the best way to do it but you know what <clears throat> issue with the grenade launcher is you can only get a couple hits with it before she starts chasing after you Let's give this another go. Hopefully our body hasn't disappeared. I'm gonna cry if it has. Mm. Right, let's give this another go. Oh, I can't believe that. K. 
Come on. Please don't have reset the zone. Please, 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 please still have my body there. Uh. Oh. I don't think the zone reset. I don't think it's reset, has it? Oh, we're in with a chance. If we die again, we... There it is! Our body! The witch is in front, but... Let's um, just grab all the guns. Uh, make it. And... Shotgun. What's the witch's health at? She's back at 2,000. Okay, let's... um. Right, and now we're going to be extra careful this time. Watching that damage. Right, where is she going to heal? There shouldn't be anywhere else she can heal at the moment. Oh, okay, so apparently she heals in her cave. Okay, out. Out. Alright, she didn't fully heal, fortunately. Right. Need to heal after every, every hit, because... When she does that, she does a lot of damage. Right. Come on. Die. We can do it. We can get the witch. Stop her from going super saiyan. Kill the wolves. Come on. Why can we... Come on, we got this. We got this. We got this, people. Come on, die. We killed the witch. We did it. We did it. And we got a head. Oh, I love you all. We did it. Oh, there we go. Second time around. Got a bit devastated the first time. We killed her and we got her head. That's awesome. And we also went complete overkill on the guns. Whew. Right. Let's take the witch's head. Now, I really need to try and get some of this stuff back to base. Hopefully... The zone won't reset when we leave and we'll be able to come back in. If not, you know what, let's, um, just in case, we'll take back the guns that have the best durability on them. So I'll take this instead of that. AK instead of half health shotgun. I, mm, that'll be fine. That's all fine. If we're lucky, it doesn't disappear. If it does, it's not the end of the world. Right. Let's go home and place down this witch head. Oh, I can't believe that. We did it. We did it, people. We got it. Woo. <laughs> oh, I'm so hyped about that. We actually managed to do it. And I... Oh, they told us to stock up on guns. That did not take anywhere near as many guns as I thought it would. As you can tell by how I went complete and utter overkill on the gun front. But... We can place down the witch's head. Right, here we go. Got the blind one there. Let's put... Oh, I can't put the witch next to the blind one's head. Hmm. Um. Okay, can't place it on that section. Let's have the witch's head. Have we got a nice section up here where I could go? Yeah, let's put it next to our door. There we go. Let's go and have a look at the witch head. Um. And probably put away a few of these guns that we um, got a little bit carried away with. Oh, we did it! 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 Awesome. Right. I, I'm i not even trying to put them where they're supposed to go, am I? Oh, well. It's not the end of the world. Okay, then. Take the nerds. Take them. Take them. Take them. Alright, so. Witch head. We need some um, charcoal or whatever to power it. Here we go, let's grab that, uh, split that so we can make another stack of 20 cooking and find out how long this will actually work for. So set the witch's head on fire. Make fire and keep it burning to avoid horde attacks. Okay, so we will definitely not get attacked by the horde for one day, seven hours. Awesome. The horde doesn't really do much to us anyway, but awesome. 
All right, I'm going to end off the episode here, people. There should be two videos out today. The next one's going to be the birthday event. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you all in a few minutes for another video. Bye!